Hello, welcome to the vlog. So I've been editing a vlog the last couple days and I decided instead of doing a couple days group together, I was gonna do a full week together. So this is gonna be the first vlog that runs from last Saturday to this Friday, which was yesterday. So I'm really excited to see how that turns out. I didn't film a ton each day because my days are getting pretty repetitive and uneventful sometimes. So I decided to group them together like that. So it's about an 11 minute vlog right now with six days worth of footage so I think it'll be pretty good like I like the style of it but I'll post that and then I'm also getting ready to film an unboxing video right now that's going to continue after this clip that I'm really excited about I ordered some stuff on Amazon so let's just get to that hello this is gonna be fun so I'm gonna make sure I'm not washed out first but something just came to the door some things just came to the door I ordered some stuff on Amazon with uh, the gift card that my parents got me for my birthday like a month and a half ago and uh, yeah I'm really excited because a lot of it is stuff that I got for vacation to prep for my vacation this summer that I never think I'd formally announced but I, like, I will eventually uh, say where I'm going as it gets closer but yeah this is a uh, this is five out of the six of the things that I ordered and the last thing is supposed to be here tomorrow so I ordered it on the 27th and today's the 29th and Prime today got me these and then the other one early tomorrow because of availability and where it was coming from. These came from Closer, I think, and then the other one's coming from Ontario. So like I said, all of this is mostly for my GoPro and the one that's coming tomorrow, I'll just insert it at the end, but the outfit might change at the end, so be aware of that. Okay, first we have... Oh, okay, yeah, so I ordered a uh, skeleton case for my GoPro because I usually just use, um, I was just using this. When I swam, I would connect the waterproof case to the outside of, I can't talk. I would connect the waterproof case to the handle and I would just use this, but um, I couldn't use this when I was vlogging or anything because it seals and this no sound can get through. So if you go back to some of like the first videos I've ever made, you can't actually hear what I'm saying because it's like muffled from the fact that I had it in a waterproof case. So I was still learning. So what I got was this skeleton case for the GoPro that I'll try. Um, I can't actually like put it on now because I'm like filming on it. So I might do a phone clip of that just to show what's going on. But um, yeah, it came with this little stand and you'll put the GoPro into this part, seal it in here, screw it in. Let me see if I can demo this a little bit better than I'm explaining. There we go. Okay, so then, and then you'll screw in this one piece that comes with it through here and then it'll sit on the mount like this. So maybe I can actually just put it on right now and then I'll show it through the camera. Okay, so I put the case on and I'll show it through the video here. So if you can see, it leaves the lens exposed just a touch, but it gives it a little bit of a shield in some way. And then I put the little stand on it just to leave it like that. So it looks pretty good. I think I'm gonna try and put it onto this because obviously when I'm walking around, I'm gonna be <laughs> so annoying, sorry. Obviously when I'm walking around, um, I can hold it on this and hopefully not like shake it as much or have it just a little more like housed in something more secure. So when I drop it, because I've dropped this a couple times. Um, when I drop it, I don't just like destroy it or dent it or like mess it up majorly, but the lens is still very exposed. So I might have to try and see if I can find something that doesn't leave the lens quite as exposed. Um, and I'll take recommendations because I would really love to have something that houses it, um, but doesn't muffle the sound and also doesn't leave the lens completely exposed. Okay, yes, the book. So my dad recommended this book, that I read this book, so I ordered it. As I was checking out, my dad was just like, oh, have you ever heard of this book? You should read it. I was like, okay, I didn't realize it was this big, but they had it on Amazon, so I bought it. It's called Working by Studs Terkel, and he said he read it and I should read it because I study psych and org psych, and um, it's just an important book, he thought, for me to read, so here we go. I bought these like GoPro mounts because I bought something. The thing that's coming tomorrow requires these. So it requires the screw in the bottom mount, not like the one that came with the skeleton case. Okay, next we have this thing. And I think this is a memory card. 
Yes, it is. Oh, cool, and it comes with this cool little thing. Okay, so um, if you have a GoPro, you know that obviously it's small and it can't house like a full-size memory card like this because it's just not big enough. So basically what you get is a smaller memory card like this, and the adapter is this larger piece. Probably the purchase I'm most excited for is this backpack that I got. It is this side satchel type thing. There's nothing in here that tells me my order again, which is fine, but I want to know the exact name of this. Uh, it's a sling backpack for men and women. It's a crossbody shoulder backpack. So um, this was the small size that I got. And basically, I think I got the right size because had it been any bigger, like it would have been like three inches longer and my torso is already quite short, so I didn't want to. But I got it in this gray color because when you hike or walk or bike or do just about anything, like I don't have actual comfortable, like I don't have a Camelback backpack here with me and I just use my purse or my um, rainbow colored backpack places or like my actual school backpack and I don't like carrying that around all the time because it's just heavy so this seemed like something that I could use it's on it's like biggest setting right now but ugh, there we go um, but when you hike and stuff on vacation it's kind of nice to have something like secure and I like I like it I don't know what it looks like on my back but it can hold a water bottle it can hold an umbrella and it can hold a lot of other things in the actual compartments let's see yeah so if you unbuckle this part you have a compartment here that might not be the safest because it doesn't have a zipper but you have a zipper compartment here in the front you have the two side pockets like i was talking about for like water bottles umbrellas things that you um can just house in the side this zipper compartment is the largest zipper compartment that they have and it has like two pockets inside this little thing it can hold quite a bit so i feel like if i I can even use this in the summer when I'm going more casually out to places where I don't want to have to carry my large backpack or just like a purse with. This is definitely something that I can use. I'll like break it in, like it'll need it that much. Um, oh, okay, so this is actually where you put your phone and there's a spot here where you can loop the headphones in up top, which is pretty cool. Do you have to break through it? Is that how that works? Okay, yeah, anyway, I've never used anything like that, but yeah, super cool, and I think that this is going to be super useful on vacation. I really, really like this, and I really like, I, I know people don't put it in the front, but like, no, but this is just to show you then. I won't wear it like this. I could, but I don't know. Anyway, here it is. Really cute. Nice color. Gray. It'll go with a lot of stuff, and uh, yeah, it's only 23 bucks, so yeah. Miso, mo, mo, mm, that's the brand. Mosiso? I don't know. I just really like the gray, so it looks really, really cool. Up a change. It's the next day. The next package arrived this morning. I went back to sleep, so it's like noon right now. I have hair everywhere. Um, last package of this little haul that we're doing. So yet another GoPro accessory I got was a tripod stand because I ooh, I feel like it was about time I had one of these and the photo of it looked really um, cool. Like I honestly really just wanted it when I saw, oh my God, it does come with the, oh my God. It just came with it. Oh, that's great. Okay, so this is actually stuck to it. So it, oh wow, okay, sorry, because it said that it wasn't like on this, so I bought all those pieces, but that's okay, now I still have extra like mount pieces for anything else. Wow, okay, so this is what the tripod looks like. Yeah, and then you hook the GoPro to the top of this, and it just kind of like, it can sit on its, I don't even know if you can see that far down, it can sit, you can wrap the legs around stuff, oh wow, or you can just like put them all in and like hold it like this, I know a lot of people do, oh wow, oh I'm excited for this, okay let's, let's try this. I'm temporarily filming on my phone because obviously my camera's right here, it does seem to fit with this new skeleton case I have. Oh my God, look, oh, sorry, you can't see. Look, 
I can hold it further away. I can hold it all the way out here. Oh my god. Okay. Well, <laughs> I can't believe this works. I'm so happy. Look at that. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. We succeeded on all of these purchases. Thank you, Amazon, for actually sending what shows in the picture. Oh, wow. Okay. Great way to start my morning. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> well, that's the haul at the new angle um, on this tripod. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep it on this tripod when I walk around today, but I'm going to play with all of the little accessories that I got for sure. And see which one I like best in terms of walking around. Um, I just can't believe that. Oh my God, I'm so happy. Like, I already have this and I already have um, the waterproof case with that. But oh my God, like adding to it in this way is so cool. Like I really have just been wanting to step up the vlog game and just have the right equipment. Like I think I've been doing pretty well for the last like nine months without anything fancy. I've honestly just been holding my GoPro completely exposed walking around. So stabilizing it and using other stuff now is going to make it look so much better and I'm so excited. Oh, wow. Okay, thanks. Oh, this may or may not be the end of this vlog, but I might actually just carry on.